Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more of the Yoshi's New Island playthrough. Last time we started World 6 and we're going to continue as such as we make further progress through World 6 and to the rest of the game. We're going to start with 6-3. We have Gargantua Blarg Attacks. So, yep, there he is. The man of the hour. The man of the hour. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of you first, just so I can get this flower. And we're going to do this, so I can get these stars. And jump over here. I know I did miss those stars, but it's not a big deal. I think this is a flower again. Yes, it is. Get the hell away from me. Who do you think you are? There we go. Okay. I think we're good. Ah! This guy. <laughs> well, this guy's back from the original Yoshi's Island. I think he's a lot easier to deal with now, because I think the fire actually killed you in the original game. But here, it just hurts you, so that's kind of nice. Okay, there we go. Now this room, I believe we have one of these Super Yoshi rooms, and this is probably the hardest one of these in the game, at least so far. I haven't gotten all the way through everything in my practice file, so there may be one more. But uh, you really need to follow the arrows on this one. Like, don't even jump unless you see the arrows. I don't know if I missed anything or not. I know I missed one coin. <sighs> I really hate sections like this where it's just like, I'm not sure. <laughs> I could go back and do the room again, I guess. I could also just move forward because I think we, we can come back here. Like This isn't a point of no return yet, so... I want to say this is stars. Yes. Uh, Fifteen red coins is always a gamble. <laughs> Whatever, I'll go for it. If this is a mistake, it's all my fault. So, I mean, 15 seems like, oh, it's just a nice rounded number. You should be fine, but then there's those times where you're not fine. Uh, so in this room right here, you actually, you have more time than you think you do. But uh, the lava at the bottom of this room is rising, so you do have to do this fast. But like I said, I think you have more time than you think you do. I could have probably skipped that, honestly. Okay, we're good. Okay, we got it. Whew! Man. I 
These levels, man, they're... <laughs> they're kind of stressful sometimes. Uh, okay, well, that's that one done. Now I just have to do one more level, and then we're at the halfway point of this world. So let's go ahead and move on to the next fort, where we have Spray Day Mayday. This level's actually kind of interesting. It kind of, it's... Kind of looks more like a World 3 castle. Which is kind of interesting, because this is not a water world by any stretch, but... You know, to each their own, I guess. So yeah, we have to deal with these guys in this fortress for some reason. It is really interesting that, again, they wanted to make these guys... Uh, Obstacle for World 8, or World 6, rather, not 8. It does have general Mario World 8 properties, though. You have to give me that. <laughs> okay, I think we're good. This is also kind of a sequel to the uh, World 4 Fortress 2. Because, once again, you'll have to go through these different rooms and find keys. Which was another aspect of that castle. I think you want to go in the pipe first. See, the thing you gotta look out for here is I believe that fish can push you into the spiky thing. Don't think there's anything up here though, so I think you're good. Once you get through with the section. Okay, hold on. Okay, those were stars. I don't think I'll need this, but I'm gonna go ahead and just bring a bullet bill just in case. Oh, no. Okay, I didn't need it. Okay, so get the key. Anything else? Nope. Nope. Okay, I think we're good. Was there a flower in that room? My god. You know what, I'm just going to bring out my notes. <laughs> I really don't want to redo this whole level again. Okay, now we're good. So another reason this level is kind of a sequel to Marching Mild's Fortress is we actually have to deal with the Milds in this level too. Also those guys, which were definitely absent in the other uh, level that they were in. I think this is not continuation. I think it's just, yeah, it's this. Just a flower? Really? Okay, then. Whatever you say, game. Whatever you say. Okay, I'm gonna... Ah. Get up here. Get up here. Ooh, there we go. creates a staircase to that which I think is not continuation because there yeah okay we can do this 
It is another submarine, though. And from what I remember, like, the angles you have to turn in this one are kind of odd. So we'll have to be careful with this one. I think you also... find secrets if you destroy enemies, yeah. Again, we have infinite retries at this, which is good. But yeah, I don't know why. It just seemed like turning this is not as... It's either not as uh, tight as it is with the other vehicles, or just the angles are just that odd in this one. I really don't know. Because I can't really turn it too sharply without the 3DS being, like, you know, sideways. And then, like, I have to, like, turn my head almost, like, 360 degrees to see what's going on. Okay, let's just... Okay, we're good. Blooper. I think we got it. Okay. We have a lot of red coins, so... I think we're doing alright. Anything up here? Doesn't seem like it. Fall down. Grab this. Now here's the thing. Do I want to... No. Okay, that's where we came from. Okay, so we're good. Not quite. It seemed like we were good, but... Whoop, 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 whoop. There we go. And there we go. Okay, I think we're done. So yeah, once again, we had to get two keys from those rooms before we could advance further. Just like the World 4 Fortress. Uh-oh. This slime block looks familiar. Okay. So here's the deal. We will have an old friend in this room. He does make a triumphant return. Guys, Salvo is back. Thankfully, he's not as hard as he is in the... Well, not that he's, like, hard, but, like... At least, destroying him with limited resources isn't as hard... If I would have not had a red egg, it would have been even easier, but that was like the one thing I had to look out for. But yeah, we have everything now, so all we have to do is get fully stocked on eggs again. Don't think there's anything else, so we'll go in here. We'll probably have a star cloud before we enter the boss room. Or just a middle ring in general, I guess. Okay. Let's do it. Eek! I don't 
don't get it. You weren't supposed to make it this far. Eee! It's all over now. Your nonsense ends here. So this is going to be the last quote-unquote Kamek fight of the game. That's really all you have to do. <laughs> the magic uh, makes uh, Tetris happen. But that's really nothing. No! Oh my god, seriously? Okay, well, you know what? I have a red egg, so whatever. Oh, I don't have a red egg now. didn't hit the... Okay, I'm just gonna... Damn it! I'm just gonna have to stall here. Or I can just use a red egg. Perfect. And... Perfect. I feel like that's the easiest of all the Kamek fights, if I'm being honest. I just got really unlucky with, like, positioning, I guess. Ag! You got past me again? This is getting silly. That is it. Young Master! Young Master? I don't want to deal with him. <laughs> At least when he's a baby, anyway. Okay, well, there we go. Mission done. Man, not gonna lie, the first half of this world has been kind of stressful. <laughs> These uh, last few recording sessions have been kind of weird, but... It is what it is. We are approaching the end of the game, after all. So, uh, next week... How about we finish this game? Sounds like a plan to me. See you guys then. Later, folks. <laughs>